Marvin Red here, and today I am doing the Ascenda BJD's BJD box tag. And hold on, Red is eating something. What do you have? Let me see. Okay. <laughs> Wait, stop. Don't pick it back up. You stop. It was an earring back. Um, <laughs> what a way to start the video. <laughs> oh, I'm doing Ascenda BJD's. Uh, yeah, Asenva BJD's BJD box tag. That's what I'm doing. Um, so the first question is, and I have them on my iPad here. The first question is, how many BJD boxes do you have on hand? Not somewhere in a storage unit. So I have, hey, 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 you cannot have her. My doll, my dog wants Dandelion, my BJD Sveta's doll, so bad. She wants to eat her so badly. So I'm going <laughs> to put her back there. <laughs> how many doll boxes do I have on hand? So I have seven doll boxes at my house and one doll bag. My resin sole didn't come in like a box box. It came in like the resin sole carrier bag. So yeah. And then I have two boxes at a friend's house. So hey, don't think about it. Don't even think about it. <laughs> you can't have her. You can't. Hey, you can't have her. Okay. I'm going to put her somewhere safe. <laughs> okay. Okay, so the next question is follow up. Where are your BJD boxes? So I am going to take you. Okay, so I have my BJD Sveta's box up there. I have my Mary Doll Round box, my Mini Fee box, and my Soul Doll box, and my Resin Soul bag, and my Teddy Doll, Teddy Bear Space Doll Nadia box. Um, then I have She's Box. You guys all know She's Box down there. Um, and then if I come over here, I have my Pookie Fees Box. Okay, so <laughs> the next question is, why do you hold on to your BJD boxes? Um, well, I hold on to them for a couple different reasons. First of all, I... I just like knowing that I have like the stuff that the doll came with like it makes me feel like official just like I uh part of the reason I keep all the COAs um and like the invoices and the emails I get from the companies and stuff I keep all of them it just makes me feel like like official like my I have an official doll um <laughs> pup 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 please don't knock anything over please um <laughs> and Another one is that if or when I move in the future after I graduate college and things, um, I want to be able to put my dolls in their boxes to, um, uh, like move them safely. So that is also a reason. And then I like to be able to prove their authenticity. So I have COAs for a lot of my dolls, but my dolls like, um, my doll Lou, my soul doll Giselle, she doesn't have a COA, but she has her box up there. So her box is a way to prove her legitimacy. Um, and then, what's another one? I just think they're cool. I like seeing all the different kinds of boxes. <laughs> I just, I just think they're neat. <laughs> okay. Um, question. Four, have you ever tried to repurpose your BJD boxes? Um, so I'm not sure if this really counts as repurposing, but my doll family box right here, um, the one that she came with. It sounded like my dog was it sounded like my dog was eating something. <laughs> um, the one that she came with, I store like all of my extra stuff in here. I can take bunny off of there. I can open it up and show you. So I have like my bag of COAs in here. I've got like wire, I've got like my little screwdriver, I got like um a face protector, a bunch of different like just a bunch of like different materials in there and stuff that I use for my BJDs a lot. So in a sense I've repurposed it as like a storage bin, but that's the the farthest I've gone with repurposing my boxes. I think that's it. I know um well, Poppy's bag, uh, my Resin Soul May's bag, her, um, 
resin still comes with like a bag i can show you here let me get up and grab it this is the bag um that she comes with like this and it had it has a little pillow in it but i'm using it for bedding on she and poppy's bed in the the bedroom behind me but um so it zips up and it has like a little thing on top and i use this to carry my um msds around and um when i'm like taking them out to take pictures so uh poppy fits in it um sasha fits in it and um Cass fits in it but she on her new body is a little too tall so i take her head off and like put a face protector on and just set her neck in the bag with the body and it all fits so it's fine so this is my msd carrying case which was the box that my the the box that my resin soul came in so Okay, and the last question is, it's not a question, it's a challenge. How high can you stack your boxes? So I'm going to reposition the camera, get all my boxes down, and then I will come back. I'll be right back. <laughs> hey, editing Marvin and editing Red here. Um, I realized that I didn't mention in the video about my giveaway. The last video I posted was a giveaway for 200 subscribers on my YouTube channel. And I just wanted to mention it again that I'm looking at my dates right here. I will be picking a winner for that on Friday the 25th of September this month and I will be um, telling you guys the winner on Saturday 26th of this month. So you have till the 25th to enter. Um, it is for a hand sewn MSD sweater. So you have plenty of time to enter. I already have a couple people entered so don't be shy to enter. So. Um, Okay, back to the video. Thanks. Okay, so I'm going to stack the boxes. So I have my soul doll box. It's not going to be that high. I don't have a lot of boxes. Okay. Soul doll and then probably my mini P box is the next biggest. cheese box but cheese is the heaviest and then I have uh Sasha's box stack it up and then let's see I think the pookie fee box should be whoa red pookie fee box should be next I have my dad came in and is talking to the dog, so that's what you hear. Uh, the 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 Pookie Fee box is next, <laughs> and then let's. See, I'll do my Mary Doll Round box. The cute little sticker of me on the side, and then I have. My race sweat dolls box. So if I had my Dolphy Dream box and I had my um, uh, Eiffel House box, it may be like a little bit taller. But uh, this is what I got for now. Are you sniffing? You smell good. <laughs> um, and then I wish I had um, my. Chateau Ada's box, but I don't. <laughs> so it's okay. This is how high it is. It is just like up to my crotch. So <laughs> that's how my doll box I have. That's how high they stack. It is not as tall as the Senvas. Hers was like oh, <laughs> so, but that's it. Um, I'm going to put my boxes back in my room before Red decides that she's going to eat them. You can see her right behind them right there. She's sniffing them. <laughs> so, um, that's it. Um, this is a really fun tag. You guys should do it too if you want to. Um, I, thought, I thought it was really fun. So, um, thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs> Sasha, what are you doing?